Missing Cat, written by Mary B. Myla and her little brother Evan skipped to the bakery to buy some cookies. Oh no, it's closed. Myla says. They see the baker inside. He looks very sad. Evan knocks on the door. The baker lets them in. Why are you sad? Myla asks. My cat is missing, and I can't find it anywhere. The baker sighs. Myla and Evan feel bad and want to help him. Don't be sad. We will find your cat. Evan says. Myla and Evan excitedly begin their quest. They look in garbage cans. They look under cars. They look around the playground. They look behind bushes. Sadly, the cat is nowhere to be found. Not giving up, they walk to the nearby woods to search. Myla spots a squirrel. Hey, have you seen a cat? She asks. To their surprise, the squirrel says yes. Follow me. He leads them to a cave. Soon they reach the cave. The cat is inside. The squirrel says, "It's very dark inside the cave." I'm afraid of the dark. Evan says, trembling. Myla holds his hand. Me too. Myla says, "But we have to help the baker find his cat. Plus, I have a flashlight." You were right. I will try. Evan replies. They go inside. Suddenly, in the dark, there are two yellow eyes that catch Evan's attention. Look, Myla! He cries out. Both of them are so scared that they start to run. Meow, meow. Oh, it turns out to be a cat, the baker's cat. Myla and Evan take the cat back to the bakery. They feel so happy that they found it. You found my cat! The baker shouts joyfully when he sees the cat. Thank you so much. We are happy to help you, Myla and Evan say. Now they realize that when you help others, you make not only them happy, but you also make yourself happy. Oh.